Hey, Pokemon trainers! Welcome to another edition of Pokemon Trading Card Game Online. Um, wow, cool couple of days um, so far. Uh, we just had a ten pack opening, which was super cool, uh, and we did grab these two brand new decks: Torrential Cannon and Relentless Flame. Uh, two super cool decks. I'm really happy with the with the way that these two play. Um, and uh, yeah, let's just jump into a game. Uh, we're still climbing up the old ladder here, trying to get to our three-star uh, zone over here. And uh, let's just jump into a game. Let's jump into a Torrential Cannon, uh, and I'm going to start doing these every other day. And I'm going to jump into another uh, tournament later on um, so that we can be able to take a look at that. So right now, let's jump into a Torrential Cannon and see if we can't grab another win off of Blastoise. The uh, win streak, as you can see right here, is up to six. Um, I don't think I've ever had it beyond six, but today might be a good day. So we have Disley, um, who is playing a Garchomp deck. Uh, psh. do we want to go first? No, we'll prevent the, uh, the first turn ascension Whew, with our Farfetch'd. <laughs> All right, that's fine. Um, having Farfetch'd early is really good. We have a Pokemon fan club. We have a Timer Ball. Uh, really liking this opening hand. Got a little bit of draw here. Got a little bit of draw there. So things are looking pretty good for us on this very first turn. Except for the fact that we don't have any other Pokemon to put on the board. But that's okay. Uh, we don't have to worry about that because we do have Pokemon fan club and Timer Ball. Uh, in order to get things rolling with our side of the, of the board here. And no Gibble as well. So... Pretty lucky. Alright, let's open with a Pokemon Fan Club, and then we can Nest Ball if we need to. So I'm going to grab a Squirtle. I'm going to grab a Psyduck. That's fine. Let me Timer Ball for a Pidgey. Can do that, and hopefully our Timer Ball can produce some Pidgeotos. I would rather have Pidgeotos rather than um, Golducks or, <clears throat> excuse me, or uh, War Turtles. I think having a Pidgey here would be good. So let's hope for a couple heads. Come on, baby, heads. There's one, and there's zero. So let's go ahead and grab our Pidgeotto because that's going to be much more useful for us in the future uh, to get things accelerated on the old board. Uh, we'll put our energy on Farfetch, and let's draw a couple cards off of that. I'm really happy with this first turn. And there's another Pidgeotto, so hopefully we can get a way to get another Pidgey on board, because uh, having two Pidgeottos on board will be really, really nice. Okay, Gumshoe is going to be a poop head, but that's okay. Identify... Yeah, so it looks like Farfetch will be going downtown here, and that's okay. This may be an early loss for us. I want to find our Pidgeot. Let's put in Psyduck so we can at least Headache next turn. Eee, not too good. Let's put this on. I could grab Golduck here, and I think I might do that. No. Well, there's no way to reliably grab Golduck. I can hope to grab Golduck here, uh, either with a Pidgeotto or with a house. So let's go ahead and Pidgeotto first. Copycat, that's fine. Let's put an energy here. And I think I'm gonna Copycat this time. Because I think that'll give us the best chance for getting a Golduck. Let's go ahead and do that. Not too pretty. Powerful Squall is going to be a big help next turn. Pidgeotto is going to be a big help next turn. I am a bit low on energy, but I think that's okay. I'm definitely going to lose Psyduck next, next turn because I have nothing but Pokemon in the old hand. Uh, but let's go ahead and Headache first and see if we can't slow down our, uh, our opponent just a little bit. Let's hope for our heads. Come on, heads. Oh. Not too good, not too good. Putting in Blastoise, though, next turn is going to be a Wonderball. And we can just hope that we get... Um, hope that we get energies in our t in the top of our in a, the top of our deck, the first six cards. So I don't mind going losing a Psyduck. That's totally okay with me. Go 
away. Uh, but we are going to be playing from the back foot coming up here. Okay, there's our other Pidgeotto. And I think we're going to copycat again after attaching all this energy. Do I want a powerful Squall first? I don't think it really matters. It's powerful Squall first. One. Well, that was unfortunate. Let's put that there. Can't help but think I should have copycatted first, but at least we might be able to get two energies here. That's fine. Let's go ahead and do another energy on here. Let's airmail. I don't know what I would even airmail for. War turtle, if I can. Let's go ahead and airmail anyways. Brock. Oh, let's grab an energy. Let's grab an energy. And let's also hope for a war turtle at some point. An energy is fine. Yeah, I should have powerful squalled this time. Jeez Louise. Jeez Louise. Um, I don't need any of this. I could switch out this Blastoise for our Squirtle just so it doesn't take too much damage. And that'll give us another nice powerful squall next time. But taking a hundred, I don't think, is going to be that bad here. Yeah, let's um, let's get a Psyduck. We'll still be looking for our Gold Ducks. That's okay. That's fine right there. I don't know if that was smart. Probably not because I'm going to lose another another um, prize card off the Squirtle. But I think after this Blastoise gets all powered up and after we get our Golduck on board and after we get our Pidgeot all powered up, uh, things should be okay. Um, it would be nice to be able to spin storm a uh, Garchomp off the board. That would be nice. Uh, it would also be nice to... We can't even Hydro Tackle it because I think they have 160. I don't remember. And that's fine. Let's put War Turtle back. Or Blastoise, sorry. Put Blastoise back in. Slow moving deck, but once it gets rolling, it, uh, it's a bit unstoppable. Uh, so let's do another Squirtle. Uh, Pokemon Fan Club? No, because I don't need it. Powerful Squall. Nothing? Are you insane? Wow. Wowie, wowie, wowie. Airmail. Golduck. It hurts me to lose that Cynthia, but that's okay. Because we super needed Golduck to be on the board. Airmail. Energy. Where were those energies? I know where they were at. No Pokemon Fan Club, no Pidgey, no Pidgeot. Don't need a Pidgeot right now. But let's go ahead and Hydra Tackle this thing. And I'm going to start throwing energy as soon as I can on uh, our Pidgeotos. So that we can get this Pidgeot ready to go and get it ready to spin storm a Garchomp off the deck. Or off the, uh, off the what you call it. Off the, uh, the board. And this is even better for spin storm because... Um, it prevents the uh, the ascensions because it puts all the Pokemon directly into the the uh, opponent's hand. So not too bad. Okay, lots of energies. Let's go ahead and get started on these. Don't need Pokemon Fan Club still. Powerful Squall. Can we have something too? Not too bad. And we'll put them both on here. Just so we can have our Pidgeot ready. Um, let's also airmail. Think how would be more prudent. Airmail. Switch. I don't need two hows in my hand. So let's go ahead and how this time. 
We did get another Psyduck. Um, don't have much in here to Brock's grid about. Uh, let's put the other Psyduck up. I'd be happy to have a War Turtle, but this is fine. Hydro Tackle. Hydro Tackle. And we are ready for Garchomp. We are ready for Garchomp uh, with our fully powered up Pidgeotto. Um, tons of energy in hand. We got to get these Golducks going. That would be really nice to have a swim. Um, I fully expect to lose our Blastoise this time, but that's okay because we have another one uh, getting ready to power up here in a moment. Um, and we can just get rid of Garchomp right now with our with our Pidgeot. Our Pidgeot. Pidgeot. And getting Royal Blaze is not too big a too big a deal to me. That's okay. I'm really looking for a War Turtle this time, though. We do have a couple Kukui's. I'm not going to use Kukui. I'm just going to spin. Well, let's go ahead and put an energy here. That's fine. Um, Pidget? No. Airmail first. I have too many friggin' uh, cards in my hand. Airmail. Golduck. Beautiful. Uh, Airmail. Cynthia needed it. Beautiful. We'll put Golduck up here. I think this time I want a Kukui. To, well, we don't need the extra. Um, what you call it off of that? Brock's Grit? Brock's Grit. We'll get these back. And we'll get some of these back. That's perfect. Super happy with that. Uh, next turn we can sit the uh, let's uh let's spin storm this fool. Get out of here. Get out of here, Garchompy. We don't want your kind here. Happy with the soul rock. I wish I could get this powered up. Um really still looking for that war turtle. Bad. Uh, amnesia is pretty good too because we can amnesia royal blades and that's not too bad uh, to get those royal blades I mean sorry uh, amnesia really want this gold duck to be fully powdered because we could take out this soul rock in one hit as it stands now we cannot do that let us still looking for war turtle Energy. Airmail. Energy. Whatever. Kukui. I think that'll be our best bet to Kukui here. And that'll just put us 10 away from getting rid of this Soul Rock. Oh, <laughs> beautiful. Absolutely wonderful. Okay, let's uh, let's whirlwind this fool. Um, or do we want to spin storm it? I think spin storm might be better. Well, it doesn't really matter, does it? At least whirlwind will do a bit of damage to it. Whirlwind. All right, pretty happy with that turn. Uh, we are walking a razor's edge right now. With our uh, with our prize cards, my opponent does have two, uh, but like I said, this is a uh, this is a slow moving deck. But once it gets moving, it's really really unstoppable. So getting this swim on my on my gold duck is going to be okay next turn. Uh, getting rid of the soul rock will be nice uh, to get us closer. This is what we were looking for. And we want our War Turtle. Beautiful. Um, 
Do I want to airmail? I think I do. Where do I want to put this energy? Let's put this here. Let me switch this gold duck out. No, I'm going to save that for amnesia. How? What would I even how for? Nothing. Switch. Golduck. Actually, it might be not a bad idea to keep Pidgeot in. Because she, she can take a Royal Blades without a Cynthia. Let's do that. We're going to kill this Soul Rock anyways. Um, Pidgeot can take a, a Royal Blades without a Cynthia to the face. Um, 140. Oh. I was confused. Um, and once we get rid of this Garchomp, we'll be good to go. So let's just hope that my opponent does not have a Cynthia. And even if he does, um, it's not going to be too bad. I think. But it would be nice to Amnesia Royal Blades. Oh, no Cynthia. Okay. I could deal with that. I could deal with that fully. Um, I don't want this. I want this. Okay, and I think right now is the time to Cynthia. I don't think I need anything else in my hand. Switch, no. Alright, let's Cynthia. Yes. Get all those back into the old deck. There's our other Cynthia, a Kakui. Let's powerful squall here. Yeah, there's three big energies. Let's put these all on Blastoise. For now. And that's beautiful. Uh, let's retreat this for Golduck and take out Riolu. Perfect. Let's put an energy onto Golduck. And let's go ahead and swim this thing out of our uh, out of our face. Bang. All right, so now we are tied with our opponent on prize cards. Another war turtle, not too bad. Uh, and we have a pull, fully charged up Pidgeot, a fully charged up Blastoise, a fully charged up Golduck. Pidgeotto's been doing work for us with the uh, airmail, um, so we're in a really good spot right now. If my opponent does not Cynthia this time, I can certainly Amnesia um, Royal Blades this turn, and, uh, and we're going to be in a really, really good spot, as long as my opponent does not Cynthia. Okay, so he decides to throw a little bit of uh, damage down on um, old Blastoise. Blastoise can take him out, so I think we're going to go ahead and do that with our switch. Uh, I don't want to Kakui this time. Let's put an energy here. Let's airmail. <laughs> don't need another Blastoise. Um, actually, shoot, I probably should have taken that. Ah, that's fine. It's fine. We're fine. This is fine. Everything's fine. Do we want a powerful squall? Let's try it. Let's see what we can grab. Two. I think I only need one. What would I put the other one on? Might as well put it on Pidgeotto, I guess. Just in case we need her. Uh, we can switch our Golduck for our Blastoise, which I think I'm going to do because I want to get the kill. So let's do that. Uh, Cynthia? Should I just show off that I have, like, multiple Cynthias? <laughs> this is a bit rude. There's all my Cynthias. Ooh, there's our Squirtle. And our War Turtle. So that's pretty good. Let's Hydro Tackle this thing. Okay, that's beautiful. Yeah, we're doing really good. Really, really good. I started off a little bit on the, uh, on the, uh, defensive at the beginning uh, but we were able to pull it right out uh, Pidget whoever they give the MVP to I'm gonna say Pidget was our MVP that spin storm was a huge help right when we were able to excuse me spin storm our um, 
and there it is. Uh, able to spin storm that Garchomp out. So uh, that was a beautiful play. Um, I, I really enjoyed that. So not too bad. Okay, two tickets, two coins. And that brings the win streak all the way up to seven. And I think we got a couple. Let's go ahead and crack into those. Four. So we got four prize boxes that we can crack into right now. Um, please do ignore the man behind the uh, curtain. I have a few packs in here. However, I'm not going to open them today because uh, we're going to save those up for a big pack opening later. I was able to trade, a, trade away a card uh, in order to get these five packs, actually. Um, so that put us on a nice boost to the next one. But right now, let's open up these chests. Bang. Okay, nice little Pokeball. Not too bad. Uh, pretty plain. Open another. Here we go. Bang. Ooh, this is a, a flip over card. Let's, uh... Let's turn it over. All right, Steven's Resolve. It's a nice foil. That's pretty cool. I like that. Open another. Hey, let's crack this baby open. Ooh, a Diggersby. Another Diggersby foil. Uh, I already have a couple of these, um, or maybe one. Uh, maybe not this one, but I do have a, a foil Diggersby. Uh, so next one. Last one. All right, let's do it. Bang. Oh, and a foil Metatang. Not too bad. Bullet Punch. I like it. All right. Thank you guys so very much for watching. I hope you guys had a great time watching. I had a great time playing. And I will see you guys in the next one.